clap. We did great. We did poorly. <laughs> Welcome to our first reunion video on the internet for yeah. both of us to be on the same screen. It's crazy. It's exciting. Yeah. We, we never do this. I never see your face on a screen <laughs> while I am also a face on a screen. Yeah, this is truly a groundbreaking thing. experience. I know. Why do we don't? Why do we not do this more often? This is so I, fun. I don't. I don't understand. I don't know. It's a strange choice we make. Yeah, but we're gathered here today to. Uh, I don't know. <laughs> what are we doing today? We're judging the final winners. Winners? Question mark? Losers? Thai? Thai people? The final attack goth of our attack <laughs> octagathon. Octagathon. Our yeah. octagathon. It's so hard to say. <laughs> we did such a bad job. We've we made yeah, we we did this to ourselves though. There's no one we can complain to. Each other, I guess. We both yeah. approved this. <laughs> uh it's great. All right. Mm -hmm. Well, I think we should start with watching your video outlining the rules so we get familiar with the rules and then compare the two videos uh from both of us. What do you think? Or maybe we can do like the first event from the rules, the first event from me, the first event from syntax, and alternate events. Uh, I don't know. What do you think? Which way is better? Um, I like alternating events. I will say, to be totally honest, most of the rules got defined more in your YouTube comment than anything. <laughs> so maybe we just like read what you read wrote in the comment. comment. Yeah. yeah, it'd be easier. Okay. Why not? Let's do it. I will share my screen. Let's read through the rules. It's the most so, exciting part of the evening as usual. Yeah, of course. We love rules. It's great. I especially love adhering to rules, which I never do. <laughs> <laughs> we both, we didn't break any rules. Neither one of us the whole time. Never. Why would we? <laughs> We're strict rule followers. Okay, let's go. Uh, so there are eight events total. The first one is push-ups. Uh, and both of us didn't have push-ups or knee, knee push-ups because I that's tried to do a real push-up. And that then I just boring. fell to the ground. It was great. I didn't even dare to try. <laughs> it's very hard. Even I feel like my half push-ups are not even push-ups though, because I feel like I wasn't dipping far enough or my back wasn't straight enough. But yeah, it's really hard to tell with half push-ups. Yeah. We follow rules here. <laughs> yeah. So we just do push-ups uh, for as much as we can do with no time limit. And the person that does the most push-ups wins. Mm -hmm. <laughs> well, I, yes, this yeah. is true. I don't know what you want me to say about it. <laughs> yeah, no. Uh, my, brain, my brain cells exit it the situation there. <laughs> uh, do you want to talk about the second task? Or sure. I guess it's not a task. Uh, events, I guess. Events. events. Our second event was knife skills, where we were tasked with dicing an entire onion into half inch pieces. We needed to be fast while also not shedding blood. The most important thing to keep in mind whenever you are knifing anything. Yeah, I think it's an important addendum since I had a track record of uh, cl cutting myself on, <laughs> uh, I don't know, kitchen knives. That's true, you do. I forget about that sometimes. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, um, yeah, and the third event is Sodoku. Uh, so we both found, uh, we were both doing the easy level Sodoku from the New York Times website and the person that um, that finished fastest wins. I said I originally said the medium level, and then I attempted a medium level puzzle on New York Times, and it took me like almost an hour to finish. And I was like, I don't have this kind of time oh. to come into an online puzzle, so let's do easy. Um, it was okay. A bit, but so it's easy. I didn't know what you'd edited. It's good to know that's what it was. I think it just defaults to medium, so I understand why that's what you tried first. Yeah. Yeah. I. Yeah. I. Yeah. Um, I don't know. That 
That is why I changed it though. I spent uh, too much time trying to finish all three puzzles that night. <laughs> yeah, understandable. I also had no self-restraint when I originally went to that link and did immediately all of the Sudoku. <laughs> It's a it's an addicting game. I can see. I can see it. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah. What's the next event? Sometimes. Sorry, I was thinking about the doko. Um, <laughs> our next event was flexibility, which we measured via forward bend. Um, theoretically, this was the shortest distance from the wrist to the ground for three seconds, according to your comment. Truly forgot that while that was happening. Um, <laughs> Uh, and neither one of us really measured. We're just going to eyeball it after yeah. the fact. I feel like uh, when we actually see the entries, it'll be uh, clear enough who was the winner there. So We also have a note that legs could be parted by about one foot, um, which I amended privately to like hip width because that is a like safe and good way to, to do a forward bend, which is like it works out to be about a foot anyway, but just like your hips are your own hip <laughs> yeah you know I, I think it's a good I think it's a good edit though because I was never taught this in all of my childhood forward bends my teacher was really adamant on everyone have to have their legs together and also have to have their knees straight which no. really wasn't the healthiest way to get flexible there so no, yeah, that you can you can absolutely hurt your legs that way you can also fall over is the thing with having yeah. your legs too close together and falling forward onto your face it's not fun <laughs> maybe not the best choice yeah all right uh next up is chugging a standard size uh can the fastest uh it, it just has to be any sort of carbonated beverage and uh start from an open can which i think i mean not much to explain there it definitely didn't break any rules at all no. Uh, also, in your original video, you said in your original rule proposal video, you said push up is the only task that we were stealing from the Vlog Brothers. Actually, they also did chugging a beverage. I think they chugged a diet Dr Pepper, if I'm correct. Was but, that in the the more recent Quadragacon? It, it is, but I also okay. watched all the uh, well, both of the Quadragacon uh, back to back, so I could be remembering it wrong. Also, yeah, I think what happened is I watched the first one before I made this video and I it had been a couple days since I had watched the more recent one and so I forgot they did it yeah they did slightly different events for the two years I guess mm -hmm. which is fair you have to have some flexibility in these things so they stay relevant <laughs> yeah. that's why there's softball in the Olympics now you should do a fact check that <laughs> I don't know if that's true <laughs> It might be we're spreading fake news here, <laughs> misinformation. I I think they were putting softball back in for this year, but it might be like next time. Anyway, that's not relevant here. Our next <laughs> task, <laughs> yeah. Our next task was um, naming as many words as possible in thirty seconds, but I'll start with the same letter chosen at random. Yeah, and then. Uh... Next one is juggling. Uh, we said uh, we are each allowed three tries and the longest airtime wins. But uh, I, when I was doing it, I did not know how to calculate airtime. So we'll, we'll see when we see the videos. Yeah, we can, we'll figure out something. Our final task was putting on the most shirts in a single minute. It's great. I love the task. <laughs> I love that you agreed to do it. Uh, the only rules. Uh, we set forth where a shirt can be anything, you know, loosely defined, as we see, um, you could take your glasses off, which um, was optional, and don't get hurt was the most important rule that we both luckily followed. Uh, arguably, I might have oh. overextended my hamstrings a bit, but apart from that, I'm on time. Well, not, in, not in the shirt's task. I not didn't make that task, no, but in general, yeah. <laughs> There were some unpleasant yeah. moments. <laughs> Aww. Shall we start the judging? I guess. That's what's left. Let's do it. Uh, I was thinking maybe we can do a side-by-side. -side. <laughs> okay. If you can make that happen on your screen, I support I you. To. I might have to reshare the, re -share the screen still. <laughs> All right. Let's do it. 
Uh, I have this preview clip. I don't know if we need to watch the preview clip. It was a truly great preview clip. I really, really appreciated it. it I love the like fast pace. It was, it's just, it, it felt so great, Alex. Chaos, it's much chaos. Okay, let, let's, 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 let's go. Let's go. Uh, on, uh, uh. Free at last. Free at last. The preview clip was truly my mood, especially the uh part when I was doing the words. Uh. <laughs> yeah. Just don't know what I'm doing. I believe that. <laughs> and there's some guys preview. <laughs> A great flop. <laughs> hey. uh, what? Half a push up. <laughs> <laughs> it's self- I feel like lowering yourself slowly down is also very hard. <laughs> It was. <laughs> <laughs> All right, first task, the push-ups. We should recount my, re redo my count though, because I'm not great at counting. All right. Yes. Go. Oh, you're, it's so hard to count because you're going so fast. <laughs> I think I two speed this clip. Are you watching in two speed? I'm I mean, not that's fine. Two speed. We can count. We can count. Count again. We can, we can count. I will do better. I sped up the video clip because I didn't want the video to be forever. Yeah, I. Yeah, I should have. <laughs> Let's count again. I didn't actually do the push ups this fast. I did get 28. Is it 28, really? I did get 28. What did okay. you get? Were you counting? I counted 25 this time, but I counted 24 last time, and I counted 28 the first time. So maybe I just can't count. Somewhere <laughs> in the range of 24 to 28. That's what we're... All right. Settling on. I don't remember how many I did, but I think that beats me no matter what. <laughs> <laughs> well, we'll see. Your video is so much calmer. Well... You did give yourself, like, very intense background music. Yeah. And I didn't beat up these push-ups, so you yeah. just get to watch. <laughs> it's so slow and torturous. Controlled. But, like, depressingly so. <laughs> this is a great job. Hello. I counted 13. I don't know, maybe I just can't count. Oh. <laughs> Well, 12 to 13 is still half of what you did. <laughs> All right. Well, our official record keeper syntax will note down the points, I guess. I will do that. I have done that. <laughs> All right. Uh, any comments or should we move on to the next, next task? What is there to say about push-ups that hasn't already been said? They're terrible. Uh, my pecs were hurting for days after it. Uh, <laughs> yeah. Do you do you feel like your um, recent 100 days attempt helped you with push-ups at all? No, because I didn't really do much push-ups in the push-up block because I don't know how to do a push-up. But <laughs> fair enough, fair enough. I tried my best. <laughs> you did, and you did good. Uh, next next event, knife skills. I don't I think I can do any more. I designed this task to win, so I must. I died laughing when you said that. <laughs> it, it matters a lot to me sometimes. <laughs> <laughs> it is, it is uh, who I am. <laughs> yeah, I know that about you. <laughs> uh, playing with knives say, who I am. <laughs> this looks very impressive and you'd never look like you're about to cut your fingers off. <laughs> I'm glad, I'm glad. I had some practice. I had some practice. So yeah. that was like 152 uh, minutes. I before I go back and look at the time again, uh, I love this face that I paused on. It's great. I it is a great face. <laughs> <laughs> All right, let's see. It's 128.02. Okay. All right. Let's do some nice skills. Nice skills. skills time. I'm gonna cut up this onion. I've really got perfect sure, timing here because I've already been that. crying, so you won't be able to tell that the onion is gonna mess with me.
I love that. I love that yours looks like so speedy, and mine is like. We're gonna take our time, settle in, <laughs> enjoy this country music, sit with me on the porch. <laughs> it's nice and nice and relaxing, you know? It's like, like you said, it's like all of the wholesome Manny videos of you slowly cutting this for I think most of what I do in me. <laughs> <laughs> it's great. It's, it's our brand. It's good. I like your knife, by the way. It's, it has character. Bread knife? I don't know if I should be cutting vegetables with it, but it is my favorite knife, so it is the one I default to. <laughs> is it a bread knife? It looks very sharp. Apparently! That's what it says on the little, like, sleeve thing where you cover the, the blades so you don't cut yourself in the drawer. Oh. But maybe it's the wrong sleeve. Hmm. It could be. Maybe it's just for really tough baguette or something. Yeah, maybe. Although I feel like you want to saw those, and it's not really a good sawing knife. <laughs> you're right, you're right. Just in the last week. I don't know. It's just like a poorly, poorly advertised knife, maybe. <laughs> it's a cool looking one. I do like it. It doesn't have to be good at what it says it does. I missed the time, but it was three minutes fifty four seconds, which Here is we go. like nearly three times as much as, as yours. <laughs> I am staking my identity in this task. So. <laughs> There's perhaps more stake <laughs> for me to win it. I mean, there are, there are tasks that I kind of thought I would win that I didn't win. So. <laughs> uh, you're foreshadowing something, maybe? I don't know. Maybe, maybe. We'll see. All right, let's go. I also, we're not discussing this. I don't know. I didn't pay any attention to how big the pieces were either. I'm sure they were not the right size. <laughs> The pieces? Yeah, I'm sure they're good. They look really finely chopped, actually. I okay. think they look, look, yeah, it looks like they're more finely chopped than mine are, honestly. But yeah, uh, I think we're gonna skip a bit. Oh my god, god. my eyes are burning. <laughs> oh, also, I made a stir fry situation with the onions. So. It looks very good. It is a good, yeah. <laughs> Excuse me. All right, Sodoku, let's go. Okay, I'm very much not confident about this, but I better give it a try. It. <laughs> uh, it's weird. Like, I don't know which one of you is talking. <laughs> <laughs> I do sound like myself. That's good. <laughs> yeah. I, yeah, I don't have any techniques with Sodoku besides just, I guess, counting a lot. Um, it is a game oh. where you count a lot. Yeah, I found these uh, pencil marking things to be really helpful for me. Yeah, I feel like they're um, a really good way to also get better. Like there are some some things that I learned specifically because I was able to use different Sudoku websites with pencil marking. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I think it's really helpful. Um, yeah, definitely couldn't t couldn't keep all that information in my brain, unlike. What, what we are going to witness next, which is a god speed run, Sodoku. <laughs> a godly I attempt. I don't think that that's maybe an exaggeration. But we'll see. We'll see. There's such calm music. I feel like the music you do these two videos should be flopped. <laughs> Look at that. How you do it? I don't understand. How is it so fast? Well, it is fed up. Not very fast. Would you like a video on how to do some Sudoku thing? Would that be oh, sure. of interest yeah. to you? That'd be kind of fun, yeah. I, love it. I could do that. I do like Sudoku. Oh, what was that? <laughs> oh, it was the noise at the end, like the victory noise, except that because I sped the Sudoku up three or four times the speed, <laughs> it was a very fast noise. <laughs> <laughs> I meant yeah. to take it out of the final video, but then I left it in. <laughs> <laughs> you also finished it in two minutes? In 12 seconds? That sounds right, yeah. Well, that's crazy. That's like, what? Three, three times my speed? <laughs> You're too good. I mean, I mean, it's because you, again, I was three times your speed in the wrong direction <laughs> on the knife skill. So <laughs> it's really just a ballot. <laughs> I think... Yeah, I, I would definitely need a lot, a lot more practice to challenge you even remotely on this task. 
<laughs> it is just a lot of practice. It's also I'm really sure fun. if you practice as much as I had, you would be <laughs> that great. Uh, too bad I haven't before a tagathon. I don't know if it's physically possible to do it before a tagathon with the time notice I had, but no, it isn't. Uh, I can almost guarantee. <laughs> didn't have years. Uh, sorry. No. no, no but, no. Yeah, I also found it funny how our screen capture programs give so much different colors um, for our screens. But. Yeah, yeah, it, it could also be like our, our computer screens as well. Mm. Yeah, uh, I don't want to listen to the the sound again. <laughs> I'm gonna skip that's, that. That's fine, please do. <laughs> it's a scary sound. I really did need to take it out. <laughs> All right, I'll move on to the flexibility task also. Uh, I'm not sure how we're measuring this, but I'm almost 100% certain that you will beat me anyway. So, I'll just do it! <laughs> that, that's, that's it. I, I don't know. What do you say? Like, 10 centimeters? 13? Well... So I know we don't love breaking our own rules, but I feel like it might be easier to measure in terms of like what part of our arm is making contact with the ground <laughs> because we can actually see that. <laughs> okay, I, I so mean, Alex gets we'll, we'll, find, we'll find the numbers to be irrelevant very fast, I think. <laughs> yeah, finger pads. That's a good, easy, easy way to measure. And a very respectable first effort. I had to move the camera because you couldn't actually see. So, look at that. Look at I, that. I did have whole hand and wrist <laughs> at various points. I don't know why, but in my brain, for this clip, you have your elbows on the floor. I don't know if that's even possible. Oh, <laughs> I, have, I haven't. I mean, there are people who can do that. I am not that good yet. Maybe one day. <laughs> yeah, but I feel like uh, even though we didn't have numbers here, uh, it's pretty clear who won this task. Sometimes you can just see what happens. Yeah. <laughs> Next task. Yeah. Soda chugging. Oh, I'm not oh boy. Sure I thought using Dr. Pepper would be a good idea. idea. Uh, this was such a mistake. Yeah, glad you're, you're just saying that right here up in the front. Yeah, I'm just going to skip to my suffering because, you know, that naive Alex didn't know what's to come. <laughs> True. We were younger then. Let's go. Look at that. Immediately failed at I'm not anymore. <laughs> I'm too cold. I mean... I'm in the fridge for too long. It was so cold that it was tough to hold on with my hands. Also, because the can is so cold, and also the bubbles are so. But I did my best. This is not a good time. <laughs> I mean, I feel like that's pretty good for drinking a whole can of soda. Like, are there people who can chug better? Yes, but they probably did much more. Uh, just good at say drinking in college than. <laughs> <laughs> Right, yeah. And I feel like beer bubbles are a different type of bubbles. I feel like Dr. Pepper's bubbles came in with a vengeance. I don't know. Yeah, there are some sodas that are like more carbonated than others, I swear. Like, people like to make jokes about like Sprite from McDonald's, but it really is insane. It's like, <laughs> it, it, like it, it, it like spans my face. I can't even. <laughs> the I one don't know that, why. That like jumps up at you from the cup. <laughs> I do love those. Soda fizz is my favorite part of soda. <laughs> <laughs> nice. Well, let's see how you enjoyed this soda task. Well, someone's showing off their engine in the background. Hello, yes, I'm aware that I'm uh, cheating, but I was too excited by the possibility of maybe good peach water. I'll make sure to get the right amount in whatever uh, drinking yeah, receptacle I'm using. I see. Well, no one was working here. It's all good. Here goes nothing. Your it's the best drinking receptacle known to man. <laughs> yeah, sure. Is. But it was terrible for chugging. That time I stood up, it was because it like filled far outside of the mouth and was getting all over my face and body, and I didn't want it to get on my computer. I have not heard good things about the finest drinking experience you can have for this moment. 
So maybe it's true. It's true. The best drinking exactly. experience is just not a good experience. And I think this it's... is best, but uh, it's just so poorly advertised. <laughs> yeah. Uh, for context, this mug came with a note on the inside that says it provides the best drinking experience or something like that. I still have the note. I used <laughs> to have it pinned to my fridge, but I took it down recently. <laughs> Yeah, f falsely advertising. Uh, mm -hmm. but yeah, um, I mean... They have big dreams. <laughs> you are uh, almost exactly a minute ahead of me for th for this one, so... And I really suffered for that minute. <laughs> oh, no. So, it's I mean, fine. There was equal suffering. <laughs> <laughs> me as well, for many minutes afterwards. It was not a good idea um, for anyone who might be watching. Don't do this. It's, it's at least now we know idea. we'll never try to do it again yeah no uh no i can say that i've done it before and uh we'll never do it again next task all right let's give it a try i have 30 seconds on the clock random word name and please give me a good letter go roman uh romain uh rip uh reap uh ripple Bold, uh, rock, rude, uh, rule, uh, ruthless, uh, rook, uh, ripple, uh, ring, uh, ring, uh. Okay, how much did you count? How many did you count? So, 13 if we're not counting ripple twice. Yeah. Which I think is fair. I don't know what the second to last word you said was, though. I haven't understood it how many times I've watched this video. The second what? The second to last word you said. I just don't know what word it was. Let, let's re-listen to it because I don't remember. What did I say? Um, ruthless. Um, look, uh, ripple. Um, ring. ring uh. Right before ring. It's not a word. Oh, it's not a word? The, the rub part? I thought I had a word, but I didn't have a word. Oh, I thought you said the word root. Oh, be before that, before Ripple, Rook. It's like the chess rook. piece, the, the chess rook. piece. That's what I was thinking. Yeah. Okay. Rook, Ripple, and then what? And then I I was going to say Rain, but I my brain shorted, and I said Rook, and then I said, no, Rain. Uh, okay. Rain. It's uh, wait, uh, rain. <laughs> okay, I think is okay, what happened. okay. Which I think makes it 12 words then. Yeah, I think it's 12. I think it's 12 not counting ripple twice, and it's 13 if count ripple twice or something. Let's see. Okay. Yeah, I think that's, I think that's how many. Okay, that tracks. All right. Uh, and syntax's task for word naming. The way now, I'm about to do our word naming task. Let's go. Umbrella, underwear, underneath, underwire, on, under. Uh, <laughs> Didn't work well for me though. Uncomfortable, unadulterated, unable, uniform, Mega. unicycle. Uh, Unicorn, um, um, is a word. Uh, is not a word. Uh, so are we counting um and uh? I don't know. <laughs> My impulse is to count um, but not uh, which makes no sense. Why? As I said in the video, <laughs> um feels like a word in the way that I tend to use it. Although here it's totally just a thinking word, so I, I get it if it's not. Uh, I have no idea. Maybe we should come back to this at the end of a tagathon judging. Well, we'll okay. I will say that if, out. if we count um as a word, then we will tie. And if we don't count it, you will win. <laughs> and I don't know how we rectify tie in individual tasks. Uh, well, um, uh, my, first, my, my current impulse is to come back to it after we judge the rest of the tasks. Okay. And the side, but that might okay. be cheating. Uh, so I don't okay. know. That's fine. We can do that. It's flexible here. 
or we could give each other a half point each. I don't know. <laughs> we'll see. We'll see what happens. Okay. Let's move on to the next task. That's good. That's I'm good. just yeah, trying to find it's not that good, but based on the back. I did not really practice this at all, so. I feel like my first attempt is for high contact. I gotta say. It looks the most juggling one. Final try. It did, it did. I don't think anything's gonna change. Yeah. So I feel like the first, the first one might be my entry out of the three. I didn't include the time because I, is... I feel like I just failed it. Uh, but yeah. Yeah, I mean, I don't know how we measure it, like in comparison to each other without assigning you some kind of time though. Is this like just the regular footage or did you speed it up at all? This is a regular footage. Okay, so what I did is on the one I decided to choose, I noted when things left my hand and then when it was clear that they had hit the ground. <laughs> and that was my like start and stop time. Uh, let's watch your attempt first and maybe we can decide that. Reverse engineer, yeah. Yeah, let's go. <laughs> Cut one. I mean, and like, that's not juggling, really. Yeah, the thing about the airtime thing of ending with hitting the ground is like, if you caught all three, you could just hold on to it for 10 seconds, and that shouldn't count, right? I, I more or less did. I mean, not for 10 seconds, but I did forget that you have to, like, throw them again as part of juggling. Yeah. I was so surprised that I caught any. <laughs> it was a great feat, though, catching everyone. But I feel like an element of juggling is to toss off each ball at different time intervals, but that might be too I, pedantic. This is probably hard to tell, but I was tossing two and then one. I just couldn't toss three separate because I don't have the hand coordination for such a thing. <laughs> so arguably you're juggling with two two items though. <laughs> well in but like once they're in the air you catch them at different times theoretically. I don't know. I just like don't know how to start. Right. Yeah I also don't know how to judge this one then. <laughs> it's a mystery to me. It's a bad task. I could, <laughs> I could suggest that maybe we would just both lose this task. We could just both lose this task. Okay, we just both got no points for this task, I guess. Juggling. No winners. Almost disliked my own video. <laughs> uh, please don't. I haven't liked these yet, but it's just because I keep forgetting. It's open in my tab. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Next task, most shirts. I love this. Uh, I want to do a side by side, but I know I sped up my video, so that's not gonna work too well. I think I also sped I'm up ready. mine though. I'm very ready. The only thing is, I might not have it. I sped that's it up. What she said? Uh, so that's what she said. Joke. <laughs> is that a that's what she said? Joke. Because <laughs> I'm tying up my hair. I'm sorry. I, I did not. Oh, I'll have okay. to explain this here, but I'm sorry. <laughs> I shouldn't have made you. It just like. Confused. <laughs> no, I'm getting serious. I'm getting ready. Tie on my hair. Anyway. Okay. Um, Sorry, friend. <laughs> no, that's fine. Probably shouldn't have made that joke. Anyway. Only one of us has sworn on the channel, and it isn't you. <laughs> I'm running out of shirts. <laughs> oh, panic. Oh, okay. So at that moment, I've actually ran out of all the shirts that I can put on by just put pulling over my head besides a really bulky hoodie that I know wouldn't fit underneath any shirts. Mm -hmm. uh, so yeah, I was panicking because by the end of my last shirt, I my time timer still haven't gone off. But as soon as I tried to grab another one, it went off. So I think this is a fair number of shirts. That's it anyway. Uh, I look like a, I look like the Michelin man now. Oh. <laughs> you can see when I turn, these are the like, previous shirts I didn't pull fully up 
that yeah. just like, crunched, crunched in there. Anyway. Yeah. It added to the Michelin Man effect. So I, I did have that. that problem as well. <laughs> <laughs> How many shirts is this? Oh, that's a loud thing. But yeah, total nine shirts. And for syntax. I love all the shirt noises. <laughs> but you were much more like meticulous on putting them on properly. I'm just like, oh, it's, I have three appendages through all three holes? That That's good enough. I thought maybe it wouldn't count if I didn't pull them down. <laughs> Ooh, this is pretty ridiculous, but I got the base shirt. One, two, Which is this shirt. three. And then four, five, six, seven, eight shirts on in one minute. All right, so I guess I'm Alex is the winner. Mm -hmm. Yeah. I have to say, this is one I thought I would win. Oh, this one? <laughs> I just, I, I've been thinking about the shirts thing for like months at this point. <laughs> But thinking isn't really practicing, is it? It's, it's like John <laughs> mentally imagining the cup stacking. Yeah. Oh, the cup stacking. I'm so glad we didn't cup stack because then, like, you'd, you'd understand that I'm maybe a little too mad for my current level of skill, but it was infuriating watching them cup stack. <laughs> well, I don't have any cups, so I'm glad we're not cup stacking. Yeah. I mean, it's just also like, I don't know. I don't know if you ever got into like watching people do the Rubik's Cube really fast. It seems like the kind of thing you might get into based on what I know about you. <laughs> but like in so comparison, good. I am a person who has gotten into at various points watching people do cup stacking <laughs> very fast. Yeah, those people are really impressive though. Unlike Hank and John Green, I have to I say. I have so bad at it. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, no, I laid out my shirts pretty meticulously, I think. I put them all one on top of each other facing the same way with the smallest shirt on top and the largest shirt on the bottom and make sure that I can just pull up the back side of the shirt and just put everything on at the same time. So I guess I did some planning for that one. No, I did also prep. I did arrange my shirts sort of laid out in a line, I guess, from smaller to larger, but I also did pick out shirts on purpose that had bigger necks so I could get them over my head very easily. You also may not have noticed this, but like half of those shirts I put on backwards. <laughs> and that was just an accident. No, I was just impressed at your speed. <laughs> was already paying attention to the shirts. But yeah. also you left your glasses on and I took mine off. Yeah, I sort of forgot about it at the time because when I originally made the rules, I was worried that I would knock them off. Mm. And I was very nervous about that but then at the time I was just like eh, you know this, I'm not thinking about this at all yeah I feel like my shirt some of my shirts have pretty tight neckline so it probably would be a disaster if I left mine on but it created yeah. a different problem because I was having a hard time finding the edge of the shirt because my eyes are so gosh darn terrible yeah um, oh. gotta lose with those eyes yeah well what what are the scores now scorekeeper well, so we do have an exciting dilemma on our hands, mm. which is that, as for a recap, Alex is the clear winner on push-ups, knife skills, and shirt stacking, okay. versus Syntax was a clear winner on Syntax, that's me, Sudoku, flexibility, and chug the task. And we, we decided eliminated no, no winners for juggling. Yeah. <laughs> and, and we, we have to word name it. So this other. really each halfway for word naming so i guess we so, joined it yeah we just have to we have to decide whether you win or we tie on word naming so this competition this competition hinges on whether um is a word all right well <laughs> <laughs> which feels very us for me at least <laughs> all right let's see um, this is the wordhood of uh, um alex uh, maybe we should just pick. Maybe we should pick a dictionary and see if it's in there. What's the What's the dictionary to to to, to test this on? Uh, Merriam-Webster feels like a fairly neutral American choice. I feel like you place too much faith in me 
for me to know how to spell Miriam Webster. I can look up Miriam Webster. Uh, I'm just going to do Oxford. But that's British. I'm not sure they spell it the same way there. Oh, I guess uh, it's not as much of a thing for them, maybe. Okay, Miriam Webster does have an entry for um. So there you go. It's a word. It's an interjection. It's there's an option to save this word, which makes it sound like a word. Yeah. Its pronunciation guide says a prolonged M sound. And then the definition mm -hmm. is used to go. indicate hesitation. It, it is pronounced differently than the way you pronounced it, but I'll let it slide. <laughs> what? How is it pronounced differently? What did they say? Mm. Mm. But I said, um. Yeah. <laughs> we like those nice middle of the road vowels here. Like, yeah. it's what I've got. It's all I have to offer. <laughs> yeah, let, let, let's make it. Let's make it a word. <laughs> if the I dictionary says it's a word, it's a word. Words aren't real anyway. So. The problem I have is Mira Webster also says, uh, uh, is a word. Um. <laughs> Do you so, want to let me win or do you want to tie? I mean, uh, I don't personally feel so like in this instance, I was not saying um as a word, but I do kind of use um in like a a way where there's like some some actual purpose to it versus like uh is much more likely for me to be just like a total speech disfluency with no like purpose other than I need to think of a word and I'm just like saying things while I think versus like um I do tend to rely on it to add like a specific like attitude or like rhythm to my speech which maybe isn't meaning but like it does change the overall meaning of a sentence sometimes okay yeah no I yeah uh I don't know I don't think I yeah, I don't think I have a strong opinion on whether they should be words, so I happily tie with you. I don't know. Exciting. That means we tie in the first whatever renewal. Hashtag is on. <laughs> We're both a tag of goths. We're both a tag of goths. Octagonians. Octagonians. Octagon. We could just be the octagon. Octagons. <laughs> Two octagons. <laughs> yeah. Well, thanks for watching and stay tuned for the next year question mark, the next attack mule, attack a thought. <laughs> <laughs> no one knows what that unit of time is. Not even <laughs> us. <laughs> uh, yeah. We'll see you next week then. I guess. <laughs> <laughs>